Hey guys, it's Jay Diamond and I am back with another video. You guys honestly don't know how excited I am to be back on YouTube. It's been so freaking long and I'm just so glad to be back. I'm so excited to become more consistent with YouTube. I honestly just want to start updating you guys on my life and just showing you guys what I do, how I live my life you know what i'm up to like i just want to build a better bond with you guys and i'm so excited for that honestly i have a lot of great videos coming on my channel so make sure to subscribe and hit that bell notification so you are notified every time i upload a new video so you guys know i had to come back with a banger of course this video has been requested literally so many times on my tiktok my instagram like every social media you can think of and you know everybody just wants to see so if you didn't already know i am a tattoo artist i've pretty much done all of my tattoos myself i only didn't do like four of them but everything else in my body i've done myself book me at pretty ink by j you can dm to book an appointment and everything else you need to know is in my bio you can always dm me if you have any questions but yeah come to me to get tired but without further ado let's get straight into the video i'm not gonna hold you guys i really don't even know how i want to do this video right now because i don't really know how i want to show you guys but i guess we'll just start off from the top let me actually pick my chair up a bit so first we're gonna start with the one right in the center this one is a heart like target um this is one of my favorite tats i don't know i love hearts and it's so like focused and like in the center um this one right here is the playboy bunny but it's a skull version this one right here says create i hope i'm showing you guys like good enough but this one right here says create but it's spelled backwards so that it can like read in the mirror over here i have two butterflies one is supposed to be blue one is purple for my two younger sisters those are their like crystal colors this one right here was my first ever tattoo i actually drew it myself um and it's for my great grandmother who passed away this one right here is blossom one of my favorite tats this one is scream but it's like a gucci version i'm gonna have to get up but this one right here is just something i drew i think i drew this in like one of my journals um yeah it's just like flowers um this one is a self-love tie it's a girl like in the mirror and we have like all of these my brats one care bears this was actually a stick and poke that i did this was one of my first tats all these right here were like my first ever like tats that i've done I have Hello Kitty art. Um, I got my mom's name with the flower. These are my hand tats. Not so much on my nails because I haven't gotten them done. But these are my hand tats, my finger tats. I have one like in the inside. Then I have this one right here that has 02. That's the year I was born. This was also like a tat that I did very early on. It's like a skull handle, a rose. Then we have these on the inside. There's an evil eye, a dragonfly. Yeah, just my little doodles. And I just wanna say a lot of these patchwork designs are like my own personal designs that I've come up with. And a lot of them are just like my own artwork. That's really what I love about tattoos. I just feel like I can express myself. I've always been like very creative as a young girl and still now like I'm just a very creative person and very artistic as well. So I don't know, I just like sometimes I draw things and then I'll just add it on myself. This one right here is one of my favorite 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 tattoos it's a hello kitty voodoo doll i was so proud of myself when i did this one um this one right here is an eye i don't know i just i drew this one and i just thought it was cool so i tatted it this is 333 this is my zodiac sign gemini right here i have a spider um this one is a barbie head that i designed um if you look close it has like hello kitty um and she has like her own tats and stuff and piercings not cute um, i have to go over this one a little bit like it was just hard for me to do up here but yeah i still think it's super cute this is the only tat that i have on my right arm i did this one with my left hand that was like the first and only tat i ever had to do with my left hand but i really want to try to tat with my left hand more um but yeah this is just a simple like red cross here i have my sun tattoo i think i really want to add on to this one but i don't know what i want to do yet 
I literally just did this Monster High one last night. So obsessed with it. Oh my god. The pink is going to get brighter since I did it last night. It's just like darker right now. But the pink is going to lighten up once it heals. And I'm super excited to see how it's going to look. I'm going to try to show you guys my back tap. Um, I got it done by an artist in Long Island. It's not done yet. I still have to get like my spine colored in. But I'm super excited to get that one done. Now onto the legs. I'm going to try my best to show you guys my leg tabs. I might have to hit my phone. I think I'm going to have to show you guys like this to make my life easier. But right here, I just have a butterfly. Over here, it says Manifest. Um, this is a Cane Corso dog. I like grew up with them. So this tat was like very special to me. Also, if you guys want a more like detailed video on what my tat mean and represent, I will definitely do a video like that. So just comment down below and let me know. Over here, I have a little angel. Right here, I have Chucky. This one... That angle was definitely not working, but I was trying to say that that one definitely has to be like touched up because I was not taking care of it and it did not heal properly. And so the scabs just like messed it up. But I'm definitely gonna go over that one because that's also one of my favorite tats. But onto the next leg. So this one right here is a snake with the heart in the middle. This one, I literally, I was bored one day and I was like drawing on my leg with pen and I drew this and then I just ended up tatting it on myself. But this is definitely one of my favorites. I feel like all my ties are my favorites. Like, I keep saying that. But literally, this is one of my favorites. Y'all, I'm so sorry for this horrible lighting. I'm not in my normal setup because I'm back at home. But so, yeah, this one right here is Hello Kitty. Kind of self-explanatory. Right here, I have my little pony. This is Kirby. My friend tatted this one on me. This one is just a lollipop. Over here is the matching tat that I have. My friend has the Bart one. I have Lisa this one says dior this one right here my girl tatted on me when she was not my girl <laughs> but this says do what makes you happy one of my other friends tatted this one on me it's just a little heart with stars this one right here is a little unicorn that my sister drew with her initial and then i have a smiley face this is a matching one with my best friend i almost forgot about this one on my other leg this is a matching tat with my sister and yeah i think those are all of my tats hopefully oh my god i almost forgot my face tat it's just a pink diamond obviously a jade diamond that's what it represents now that should be all of my tats but like i said before if you guys want a more detailed video on like what my tattoos represent i will definitely do a video like that so just leave a comment down below and let me know what you guys want to see from me thank you so much for watching i really love you guys for the continuous support that you guys give me and all the love i just love you guys so freaking much i'm really so excited for this youtube journey that i am about to take so please make sure you are subscribed and click that bell to turn on my post notifications so you're notified every time i upload a new video thank you guys so much for watching bye